Hey guys, it's Kyle. For this week's video, I decided I would help you guys by giving you some advice. So I went on Twitter and on Tumblr and I asked you guys to send me some advice questions. So let's get right to it. As you can see, I have um, quite a few advice questions and I am going to do my best to answer them to the best of my ability. From Anonymous, how do you get your friend to stop hating and ignoring you? Because it's sad. If they're ignoring you because they're mad at you, then um, I guess uh, apologize, even if you don't feel like you're wrong. Really, in this situation, what you should do is just try talking to them, be nice, don't accuse them of anything. From Anonymous, Kyle, how should I cope with being left out of conversations and fun all the time by my classmates? What you should do is make yourself involved in the conversation and or fun time that is going on in the classroom. If you're just like in your classroom and sitting down doing nothing, you can't really expect your classmates to just come to you and involve you in the conversation and involve you in the fun. What you need to do is you need to go to them. If there's a group of people talking about something, squeeze yourself into the group. Anonymous asks, what do I do if I like a guy, but I'm too nervous to ask if he likes me back? You need to go up to him and just be like, hey baby, do you wanna go out sometime? And then he'll be like, yeah. Or he'll be like, no. And you'll have your answer. Spectral Literature asked, how do you tell your friend she's a slut? In a nice way. This is what I would do. You make a diagram of all of the boys and or girls that your friend has slept with and bring this diagram to her attention and say, this is how many people you've slept with. Fix that. Anonymous asked, no one is subscribing to me. What do I do? Well, Anonymous, if you are a YouTuber making videos and your videos are not getting views or as many views as you want, you need to promote yourself, get yourself out there. <coughs> oh my god. It all starts with your videos. If you're filming your videos with your phone, front camera, up and down, what is that called, like vertical or something, then your videos are not gonna get a lot of views because a lot of people don't like watching videos that literally look like this. If your phone is your only way of filming yourself, don't use front camera, don't go vertical. Use the back camera, go horizontal, put it somewhere, just down so it can see you, and then film yourself with that because your back camera is it's a lot better quality than your front camera. Okay, so there's a filming lesson for you. Now, as for the subscribers part of the question, which is actually the only thing you asked, <laughs> I want to get your video content, you know, better, as on point as you can get it. That's when you need to start promoting yourself. What I do is, I just like, I tweet my videos, I get, I try to get, I do everything I can on Twitter to get myself out there. And you can do that too. Twitter is a great tool for getting yourself out there or promoting yourself. Use Twitter to your advantage. From Anonymous, my friend has been treating me really bad lately. If I bring it up, they get mad at me. What do I do? Well, Anonymous, you need to cut this friend out of your life. You don't need that kind of negativity in your life. If someone's being mean to you and you can't go to them about them being mean to you, then they're not a good friend. Oh my, it's all of asked. Kyle. What? Jennifer Butt asked. How do I become internet famous? Well, there's a few ways to do this. You can um, post nudes on the internet. You can buy a million followers on Twitter because then you'd have a million followers. I mean, even though they're fake. Or you can do what I do and sit in front of a camera and embarrass yourself. Anonymous asks, how do you politely ask someone if they're gay? I really like this guy, but I think he might be gay. I don't know what to do. Well, <laughs> it's a tough one. If um, you don't know if they're gay, then I guess that means you're not supposed to know. Oh my god, chill out downstairs. Literally, I am trying to film a video. You could do two things with this. You could either kind of become closer friends with them and maybe hint at you being very supportive of like LGBT stuff. That will make them maybe feel more comfortable coming out to you about it. And if after like, a while they never come out to you about it, then I guess that means they're not gay and um, go for it. Another approach you could take is you could just, right now, go ahead and ask them out and if they say no, then they're either gay 
or they just don't like you. But either way, you already asked them out and they said no, so there's nothing you can really do. And anyway, that is all of the advice questions that I got. If um, you want to ask a question in my next advice video, then definitely follow me on Twitter. Thanks for the advice questions, you guys. This is really fun. I feel like I might have helped like one person. Make sure to give this a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not. And I'll see you guys next week. Make sure you all stay perfect.